More people are heading back to school or getting ready to go back to school. Shopping doesn't just mean getting ready for supplies for the classroom. It also means new clothes or for some places uniforms. Now before you head to the stores, make sure you check any updated guidelines in your district's dress code policy. Dress codes in some schools are being enforced more and slight changes are being made. According to Tony Chrysler, the community relations person for the Hines County School District, their biggest change this year is loosening the use of masks, making them optional. If the children feel comfortable that they need to wear a mask, that's fine, but we don't make it a requirement anymore. Parents, take note. Another big policy schools are cracking down on, shirts. Madison, Rankin, and Hines County School Districts have prohibited crop tops. All short and long sleeve shirts must cover the stomach. Shorts and skirts must be a certain length governed by the district. Pants are not allowed to have holes and pajamas are now prohibited across all three districts. Some schools in Madison County as well as the Jackson Public School District have a uniform style dress code. For elementary and middle school students at JPS, tops must be white or navy blue and bottoms must be either khaki or navy blue. Not everyone has the budget to meet all of the dress code requirements, but the school says says in many cases they can help. We have resources, we have people that we can rely on to help you with assistance to get what you need because um, it, it is a requirement. Now also for the Hines County School District, besides the dress code, all students are actually required to have a clear book bag if the, you are in need of one, the district is able to provide it. All right, let's switch gears. Over.